Hello and welcome, Plainfield Central, to Field of Friday. My name is Colin Bastion. And I'm Megan Finelli. Today's word of the day is virtuoso, a person who has a special, special knowledge or skill in a field, a person who excels in music technique or execution. Good luck to the JV and varsity Palmcats who will be competing at the Plainfield East Invite this Sunday. Students who need to stay after school with a teacher or coach must be with that teacher or coach. Any students not with a teacher or coach need to leave the building. The halls of PHS close at 2.30. Students are reminded to dress for the weather. Blankets, coats, and gloves may not be worn during the school day. Have you ordered your yearbook yet? Yearbooks are $50 and will be sold for only a few more months. If you have not yet ordered your yearbook, stop by the main office and pick up an order form soon. Now to Mr. Harrison for the weather. Hello guys, me again, and Happy New Year's. Um, unlike the way the winter's been so far, maybe you remember some of the maps I've had up here before, maps have had quite a bit of red and orange on them. This time it doesn't. It's done quite a bit of blue. Um, this is like the six to 10 day temperature forecast. Uh, notice that pretty big area of blue here, which means below normal temperatures. So, you know, since it's been so warm this winter, this is gonna sort of feel like a real shocker. Um, anyway, like I said, call next week. Back to you. There will be a Plainfield Rugby informational meeting on Wednesday, January 13th in room 1507 at 2.20. No experience is necessary and there are boys and girls teams. All are welcome. Boys track and field athletes. The boys track and field team is looking to continue its streak of state medals, especially after last year's fourth place finish in Illinois. To all those interested in continuing our tradition, there will be a final informational meeting that will take place on Thursday, January 14th at 2.30 in the main cafeteria. This meeting is for all athletes interested in the track that have not currently been involved in a winter sport. Remember, there is no difference between indoor and outdoor track. Unless you are involved in a winter sport, you must register, submit your physical, and attend our practices in January. If you are unable to attend the meeting, please be sure to see Coach Pereiro in 2205. The first musical meeting will be on Monday, January 11th, after school until approximately 5 p.m. to receive rehearsal materials and view the movie. This is a mandatory meeting for all cast and crew members. Make sure to split time with the musical first so that you don't miss important information and policies. Magic Club is up and running again for the second semester. Magic Club gathers in room 1604 on Mondays at 2.20. See Ms. Carlson in room 1604 if you have any questions. Attention students, the student phone in the main office is to be used for emergencies only. You may only ask to call home during your lunch period and you must ask the secretary for permission to use the phone. You must also provide the reason why you need to call home. Attention students, who has made an impact on you? The PTSO needs you to nominate any staff member for the annual CAPE Award. Please pick up nomination forms at the Raptor desk and turn them in by January 20th. Questions? Come to our next PTSO meeting on Monday, January 11th at 6.30 in the Media Center. Now to the sports video. Morning, Wildcats. Mr. Coventry here with your sports flash. This weekend, the NFL playoffs start. And unfortunately, the Bears will be sitting this one out. we got a couple feature games this weekend. We have Washington Redskins will be hosting the Green Bay Packers. Some people love them, some people hate the Packers. But it should be an outstanding game. Both teams will have opportunities to move the football. The Washington defense, not so hot. Green Bay offense has been struggling. This is a matchup where it might work to their benefit. Watch this game. It should be a great one, but I have a feeling Aaron Rodgers has one more in his bag of tricks to pull this one out. And the other feature game will be on Saturday night when Pittsburgh Steelers travel to the Cincinnati Bengals. Now Andy Dalton, starting quarterback for Cincinnati, will be sitting it out, but the Steelers will also likely be without their starting running back, D'Angelo Williams. It should be a fantastic game, potentially high scoring. Look for the Steelers to pull this one out through the passing arm of Ben Roethlisberger. Have a great weekend and enjoy the game, Wildcats. This has been your Fielder Friday announcements for January 8th, 2016. Make sure to visit the Fielder website for more updates and to vote in polls. And remember, Plainfield Central, have a Wildcat day.